Well, this does not look healthy. <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> Hello, everyone. I'm so happy to see you today. We are trying a demo. Um, it's called Bonded Spirits. It is free on Steam to try out right now. And I don't know anything at all about it. Never heard of it. So I'm jumping into this completely blind. Keep in mind, this is a demo. It is set to release sometime next year. It doesn't specify, but I'm assuming that means a lot of what's in this demo is likely to change. So any criticism I give is not meant to be mean or harsh. It's mainly just to say like, okay, maybe this is something that could be changed in the release of the game. And I don't mean any harm by it. So before we get started today, if you are new to the channel, please consider subscribing because I would absolutely love to have you. And let's just jump right into this. Okay, so we'll be able to choose a character in the full version. So obviously we're gonna go with this one. Name myself. Oh, that's a cute animation. Little puddle horse. I love the color scheme, very familiar. <laughs> Whoa, what was that? It is a little rundown, but charming. It only needs a little love, love that you don't have. Oh, <laughs> how sad. You are here as punishment after all. What? Why? It's unfair, really. All you did was gamble away nearly all of your father's money, <laughs> almost putting him in debt. He should have forgiven you as he usually would. What? What kind of story is this? Instead, he sent you here to teach you some responsibility. To help you with that, your father put you in the hands of Jackson, the manager of the ranch, who just so happens to be calling you right now. Oh, my. <laughs> that's horrifying. Uh, hi there. Hello. This is Jackson. Your old man told me to show you the ropes around here, but honestly, I don't have time to babysit you. Tell me, have you ever had a dog or a cat? Uh, yes, we had dogs. You ever picked up after them? Um, pick up what? You know, clean up after them. Oh, no, I never had to. Okay, listen. Obviously, neither of us want you to be here, so let's get this over with as soon as possible. Go find Robbie. They will help you find a horse, learn to brush it, maybe clean it. <laughs> maybe, maybe clean it. Then we'll call your old man and get you back home so you don't have to dirty your fingernails. I... You don't have to be so rude. <laughs> oh, this is funny. Okay. I'm being realistic is all. Now off you go. Some of us have work to do. Bye. So this is me. Me, the gambling, horrible person, I guess. We've got a quest log. Yeah, I'm walking like I'm angry. Oh, gosh. The scenery is beautiful. I do have to say that. Although, it just, this movement feels weird. Oh, there's chickens. Can I, oh, there we go. Oh gosh, <laughs> just kind of skating all around. All right. Oh, I see dressage. You must be Robbie. Hey, you must be the boss's kid. I'm Robbie. I'll help you get started. So I, um, hi or hi, Robbie. Finally, someone who doesn't seem to be annoyed by my presence here. I'll say that. Oh, right. You already spoke with Jackson. Don't mind him. He's overworked and grumpy. Doesn't even have the time to greet you in person, that guy. Seriously, he's turning into a bit of a workaholic. Now let's get to your horse, huh? Sure. You might not know this, but horses actually have a variety of personalities. Of course, some of them won't show it at first glance, so you'll have to get to know them a little bit better before they feel comfortable enough around you. Go ahead and pick a horse that you would like to get to know better. Well, I have so many choices, but I guess I'll just go with this one. We'll name him Magic. Aww. Cute little old Magic. That horse kind of looks like the horse... Whoa. What is this? Oh, I have a text message. This is Jackson. Use this number to message me. If something goes wrong, don't overuse it. Okay. That's kind of a, a cool concept. I told you not to overuse it. Sheesh, you're grumpy even through text. Seriously. That guy's problem. 
All right, so we have our horse's mood here in my phone. That's convenient. He's doesn't need as much sleep. He's an introvert. You and me both. <laughs> he likes sugar. He's slow. Got a lot of endurance. And he's not a good jumper. Okay. So it wants me to grab a treat. The treat's in here. Oh, ha, huh, the big green arrow. It's kind of obvious. Some creaky floor. Here we go, some sugar. That is what my horse likes, after all. Hello, magic. Okay, so back to what I was saying about this horse model. It looks a lot like the one from, I think it was Horse Shelter 2022 or something. Looks very, very similar. Okay, so we're going to pet him. Oh. No, I didn't want to feed him. How do I just pet him? Okay, there we go. Now I need to buy a saddle. So we're going to open our phone. Go to shop. Items. Saddle. Wait, did I buy it? I don't know. Apparently I did not. Oh, it's in my cart. Okay. <laughs> So go to the cart, order, yes. Now I need to get the saddle from the chest. I'm assuming putting it on the hot bar is the best thing. I'm stuck. Why am I stuck? So, so far I like the phone element and that kind of stuff. Ooh, but the movement is just, ooh, it's glitchy. Okay, let's put on your saddle. Oh, wow, I just pulled that out of nowhere. <laughs> Get on the horse. R to mount the horse. All right. Oh. <laughs> what? I wasn't even trying to go for any... What just happened? It doesn't trust me enough to even leave its stall, apparently. Okay, let's go find Robbie and tell her we managed to saddle the horse, but cannot ride the horse. Good job, you're riding your- I'm literally not. I'm literally not riding my horse. <laughs> I can see that both of you are still nervous, so I think it would do you both good to get even friendlier before we do anything more difficult. <laughs> what? Spend time with your horse, and once you feel like you've grown a little closer, let me know. Dang, she gave me 200 bucks for that. So how am I going to ride the horse? I mean, all right, let's just try it again. Maybe I had to complete that quest first before it would let me leave. Level up bonding. I'll just pet him. Pet him again. I see that the bar is going up in the top left corner. Oh. <laughs> what was that? Okay, level two now. So maybe we can ride out of the stall. Your horse needs more movement. Let it out of its stall or take it out. Your horse is in a great shape. Keep it up. All right. Hey, we're almost out of the stall. Oh, gosh. Oh, these controls are not going to be good. Look at that tail wag. <laughs> His whole booty is just going back and forth. Use M to change movement mode. M. Change to a faster gate in manual mode. Okay, that's better. All right, so at first... Holding down W would make your horse walk and then slowly trot. And trying to manage that is... <laughs> I'm sorry, but both of these characters <laughs> have this, like, shimmy going on in the back there. Uh, it was like... <laughs> uh, all right, anyways. Um, why does the horse look like it's just miserably trotting along. Look at the back legs. Oh, that's, that's rough. It's like, it looks like it's really struggling. Really, really struggling. Okay, we finally made it back to Robbie. Hopefully I can talk to her from the horse. Stop horse, oh my gosh. Oh, oh, that's right, S does not slow it down. Hold on, is it Q? Okay. 
That's very, very interesting. Oh my gosh, an E makes it go faster. Ah! Okay, stop. There we go. Oh. <laughs> All right. You look more confident. Absolutely not. Don't try anything reckless. Let's just run around. That does not make any sense. All right, let's go to the arena and see how this goes. Come on, horse. Can I go faster? Oh, nope. I cannot change speed due to my stat level. All right, I kind of like that though. Because, uh, well, there's a lot wrong with this for a complete beginner doing this all alone, but at least it takes into consideration that I'm a new rider, so I shouldn't go faster than a trot, I guess. Let's go with course one. I believe it's the safest. Wait, now I'm jumping? Okay, I retract everything I just said. Let's go magic. Wow. That was quite the jump. <laughs> I thought his stats said that he wasn't a high jumper. He's over jumping these by a lot. I want to point out that I appreciate that you can change how the controls work for your horse. So hitting M takes it from manual to it will do it automatically so that just you hold down W and the horse will go up to a trot. You hold down S and it slows back down. It just won't hold the gate. So I like that it's you can change it, though. That's nice. The extra options are nice. All right. Five stars. I'm a natural. Oh, I got a text. Oh my gosh, I just want to slow down. Uh, finish the pleasant conversation. I have a ple pleasant conversation. Hey, are you the guy that moved to the old farm? Um, yes, but who are you and how did you get my number? You can see my name on your screen. It doesn't matter how I got your number. I just want you gone, you and your dirty horses. What? Listen, lady, nobody wants me to leave more than I do myself, but it's not that easy. It is easy. Just leave and take those horses with you while you're at it. A nice one. Wow, you're really not a fan of horses, huh? You're annoying. Leave before I make you. Haha, uh -huh, okay, crazy. All right. That was interesting. We'll just... Oh, goodness, Robbie, what do you need? Look at you. You look like you were born on a horse. Really? I think it's time for you to go explore some of the beautiful scenery around the farm. I can say wait or yeah, let's just do it. Make sure you take a picture somewhere pretty with your horse. So I know how far you went and keep an eye out for any lost chickens. <laughs> okay. Have fun. Let's go. What are you doing? Why are you stopping? Gosh, this walking animation is rough. <laughs> I'm sorry, but it. Ooh. All right. Can we go a little bit faster now? There we go. How does the trot look? The trot is better. It's better than the walk. I mean, the way that the the hind end, basically the horse's butt, the way it's shaking like that. Why is the tail moving? It's like it's so unnatural looking. Oh, it's nighttime. We're just going to go on a night ride. I mean, we're completely new to riding, but why not? So anything negative I'm saying, I understand this is a demo version. These things could change. Hopefully they do. The scenery is beautiful, though. Really, really like the background. Can I go faster? Nope. Not yet. And this seems like a nice trail. Really mountainous. Your horse would trust you more if you kept it clean. Well, we've been on a ride. Am I supposed to just stop and clean him in the middle of the ride? Oh, I can canter now. Whoa. He's going really, really fast. Oh, gosh. Oh, my gosh. I got this. I got this. Slow down. Slow down, horse. Jeez. Really putting power into that. Take a photo. Oh, okay. You got to stop. Slow down, horse. Slow down, horse. Okay. Photo. Oh. I look so thrilled. <laughs> All right, we'll save that one. Continue your ride. Oh, 
Well, since the horse just kept running up the mountain. Come on, horse. Oh my gosh. There we go. Okay. So this seems like a slower canter. I think before I was holding down W, so it really made the horse take off. Look at the character. <laughs> it's just kind of going back and forth. Okay, this is better. That's not so bad. Oh gosh. Oh! I keep hitting S to slow down and that is not the key. Luckily those can be changed though, so I appreciate that. I mean, again, it just, it really looks like the horse is just, like, I don't know, struggling, really struggling to propel itself forward. I don't know if that makes any sense. It feels heavy. Okay, so let's find, what are we supposed to do? What's up with that hut on your ranch? Wait, this is my ranch? I thought I was sent here as punishment. But now I own it? So confused. And he really did get filthy on that ride somehow. Wait, where do I go? <gasps> oh gosh. Stop, 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 stop. What is this? Eddie. <laughs> Apparently somebody lives here. What a cute little hut. Thanks. <laughs> yes, I'm gonna say ah. Um, who are you or this is private property? I don't understand how we're now the owner of this property. It never explained that. I'm just gonna say, who are you? I live here. All right, apparently so do I. That doesn't really answer my question. I don't have to answer your question. Wow, this guy is just talking in circles. Um, yes, you should, considering you're apparently living on my property. Are you not going to say anything? Ugh, whatever. Hey, instead of freeloading off my land, why don't you and I strike a deal? You made this little hut yourself, right? Yes. How about you help me renovate these hovels? What hovels? Um, and I let you live my land for free. <laughs> Living here in exchange for my labor is not free. Or I could also just call the police. Deal. What is this? And now I'm just going to upgrade my stable immediately? Oh my gosh, everything's happening so fast. I need to try out the dressage. It looks like there's some sort of activity. Okay, let's just upgrade the stable, I guess. Only a hundred bucks. Nice. So we can change the wall color. Okay. Furniture does nothing. That's pretty neat, though. I mean, a lot of times in these games, there's no customization whatsoever to the to the barn, so I kind of like that. Except. Okay. That's it. That was the whole demo. All right. Um. Oh yeah, we never found the chicken. That's true. So I'm back in the game because I want to see if there are dressage mechanics since it just kind of ended after that. And then I think I'm gonna try and get the chicken too. We're just gonna rush through this. Well, this does not look healthy. <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> I'm just doing my uh, my one-legged exercises. Got to build up those muscles, you know. Might be throwing my knee out in the process, but it's fine. <laughs> oh, okay. Now we're on to just normal squats. <laughs> Very fast, powerful squats. One, two, one, two, one, two. <laughs> oh, I'm having way too much fun with this. Let's go ahead and try this exercise. Oh, it's jumping. It's not dressage. I went way off course from where I'm supposed to be for the quest. Ooh, there's like tents and stuff up there. I wonder if the chicken's over there. Mm, doesn't seem like it. I'm gonna work my way back toward the marker. Hopefully it's not too difficult. This is not a great place to be lost. Whoa. <laughs> my horse is like a, a mountain goat. It's too bad it's nighttime. It's gonna be really difficult to see. Couldn't find the chicken. I kind of looked around the general trail of where the markers were, but no luck. Oh goodness. 
Oh! <laughs> so, I'm assuming I'm not supposed to go this far. Horse is breaking due to detecting obstacle in front of him. Well, there is an obstacle. I mean, honestly, this map kind of just goes on and on. Oh. <laughs> Whee! So, I just fell out of the world. Um, I'm assuming that's going to be the end of the gameplay. Hey, my bond got <laughs> went up by 30 from falling out of the world, so that's interesting. This is my third time loading up the game, by the way. My horse escaped his stall, and I, I don't know where he... <laughs> what? What the heck? Whoa! What's he doing? Somehow made it to this stall, and uh, he looks like he's in some sort of distress. Good news is I can wall climb, so... Anyway, that's gonna be it for this demo. There's some promising things to it. I like the cell phone system. It looks like you're gonna be able to manage your ranch from here. And I like that the horse has skills down here. That's really fun. Ranch of Rivershine proves that leveling skills on your horses is actually a lot of fun. And then all these different meters. So for hunger, thirst, energy, all of that. There are different likes and dislikes. Hopefully, as long as it means something to the mechanics of the game, I like that. That's a nice addition. So there are promising things here. Uh, obviously, <laughs> from what you can see in front of me, there's a lot of bugs. But it is a demo and there's a lot of time to fix that. And then, you know, the little stuff like the horse's gates and and um, just all that kind of stuff that still needs ironing out. Uh, but yeah, once this game is fully released, I will probably end up buying it and doing a full review of it. So we will look forward to that in 2024. Thank you guys so much for being here. And until next time, bye.